Hey up pancakes, today we are here with a vortex boss guide. This is a normal one of course, and we're gonna just use strike on this. Uh, and then just head into your new game. And then the first thing you want to do is get your free glue gunner down here. Set to last, and then get striker down here. Okay, now since you've done that, what you want to do is get a farm and put in this back corner and get it to a 200. I will be back once I've done that. See you then. Okay, Pancakers, now what you want to do is save up for a dart monkey to place right here. After you've placed down that mon dart monkey, you want to get it to a 012. Then you want to get this to a 010. And then place down two more 200 farms, one right here and one right here. I will be back once I've done that, see you then. Okay, Pancakers, welcome back. The next thing you want to do is save up for a power pilot to put right here. And then you want to set that power pilot to um, just stay right here, lock in place. After you've done that, you want to get a farm down right in this corner. Um, and then you want to get that farm to a 102. Not farm, a village. Sorry. One of these. Right here, and you want to get to a 102. And then get another farm to a 200 here, and another one here. I'll be back once I've done that. See you then. Okay, Pancakers, welcome back. The next thing you want to do is you want to put a sniper right here, around the edge of this. Set to strong, get to Pomero Jacket. After you've done that, you want to save up to get this to a 220. And then get a. Uh, then you want to save up to get monkey farm, right? Not monkey farm, monkey village right here. And then I will be back uh, right before the next boss. I'll see you then. Okay, pancakes, welcome back. The first thing you want to do is get this to a primary mentoring, grow blocker, radar scanner. And then you want to get this to a glue cell. After you've done that, you want to get this to a semi-auto. And then you want to get a tax shooter down here. A bomb shooter right here. Like right in this little corner here. And then you want to get another tax shooter over here. After you do that, you want to get another sniper down right here. And another one down here. And then finally another one right here. Then you want to get this one set to strong, fast firing, and start the boss. You then want to get to a full metal jacket, and then faster firing. And then you want to get this one to night vision goggles, strapper shot, and fast firing. After you get to fast firing, you want to get faster firing on it, and then go to your next one and get to strapper shot, fast firing, faster firing. Then you want to pause for a second, get this set to strong, get to fast reload bigger bombs, and then get this to more attacks, faster shooting, and this to more attacks, faster shooting. Then what you want to do is you want to get this to a large caliber. You want to get this to a large caliber. And then get this to a semi-auto. After you get that to a semi-auto, you want to go to this one and get this one to a semi-auto. And as you see, we're taking care of the things decently well. Now you get this to a semi-auto. And now what you want to do is you want to start getting these to long life valuable bananas. Make sure to set one of these to first if those are getting by. Then you want to get this one to the same thing, and now this to that exact same. And now you want to get this to a banana plantation. And that will uh, hinder your money production a little bit, but it should be fine. And we're just doing more and more damage to it. Now you get bana a banana plantation and you just want to start getting all of these to banana plantations. Uh, 
Okay, and now what you want to just do is get everything, all of these to a banana plantation. And then you want to try to get this to a banana resource facility. I will be back once I've done that. See you then. Welcome back, Pancakers. Now what you want to do is you want to get this to a full auto rifle. And then uh, save up till right before the boss. I will see you then. Welcome back, Pancakers. Now what you want to do is get this to an elite defender. Get this to semi-auto. And then get this to a down jack. After you've done that, um, you just want to start the boss. And just watch as you start doing a ton of damage to it. Then you want to get a mortar monkey right here. Get to increase the accuracy for any stuff signal flare, rapid reload, and set it to like right there. And now you want to save up for another banana resource facility. But before you save up for another banana resource facility, quickly get this during a fire, even more attacks. You also want to set this to first now. But yeah, get a banana resource facility. And we're just going to be waiting. Because uh, we're going to set back to strong, by the way, after round 63. The reason we're doing it like that is we just don't want to lose to round 63. And round 63 is over, so we're saying this back to Sean. Now we're getting this to a banana resource facility soon. If you see that stuff like this too, you can set this back to first. And then to strong so your um, normal dudes can take care of it. And now since we have a banana resource facility, what we want to do is we want to get this to a monkey town, monkey city, with jungle drums. But we want to get jungle drums after we get the monkey city. I will be back once I get a uh, monkey city with jungle drums and yeah, so I'll see you then. Okay pancakers, welcome back. The first thing you want to do is put a farm right here. You should be able to barely put it in range, like that. And then you want to get that to a banana plantation and then get to long life valuable net bananas and then you want to start getting banana resource facilities up until wave 75. After you get to wave 75 you want to start saving for the next boss. I'll see you then. Hey pancakers, welcome back. The first thing you want to do is upgrade this to your premium expertise. Get this to heavy bombs, missile launcher, mobile marler. Then you want to get this to corrosive glue, glue splatter. This to very quick shots, crossbow. And then this down even faster shooting, even more tax, tax burn. After you've done that, you want to get another sniper monkey right here. And you want to get this set to strong and then down to main mode, cripple moab, fast firing, even faster firing. Then after you have done that, you want to get this to a mob assassin and then this to an overdrive. Before getting this to a full auto rifle. After you've done that, you want to be getting dot monkeys in here. And you do get free dot monkeys because of the monkey city. And then you want to put one right here. And you want this one to be set to last. Get very quick shots. And then you want to get this to a spiker poke juggernaut. All of these you want to get to quick shots. And then enhanced eyesight. And then you want to get one more down here. To uh, quick shots enhanced eyesight. And you want to start the boss and get this to crossbower, get this one to sharpshooter, and then get this one to sharpshooter. After you've done that, you want to get this to a full auto rifle, and then this to a full auto rifle. You also want to use your mob assassin ability when you can. Slow down the pace of the game, and then get a sniper right here. And then you want to get this to a bouncing bullet. Set to first, and then you want to get another bouncing bolt right here. Set to first, and yeah, another one right here. Set to first, after you've done that, you want to get this to a support neck, 
and then you want to get these two supply drops. As you can see, the boss is going down decently quickly. A supply drop. And now we're about ready to pop its last um, layer. After that um, thing goes down, use your Mob Assassin because I'll just do extra damage to it. And now what you want to do is you want to get every single one of these to triple shot. Because it will drastically increase the damage output on them. I forgot to get that to where I needed it to be to. Make sure this is still set to strong by the way. After you do that get a balloon solver balloon liquefier. And then get this to your balloon solver. After you get to your balloon solver, what you want to do is get a sniper monkey right here. Get another one right here and another one right here. After you've gotten those ones, you want to get yet another one right here. And so you should have seven total snipers. After you've done that, you want to get each one of these snipers to a supply drop. And then you want to get this one to an elite sniper. Make sure to be using your money abilities throughout the thing. I'm going to wait to have them all timed on the same thing. Um, so I will have a bit of less money but I won't have to micro it as hard. Um, and then just continue going on with the thing. I'll see you at round 90, like right before round 99. Also, if you get all of those through there and it's before round 95, you can upgrade this to Monkeyopolis. And then you just want to keep getting farms around there. I'll see you at round 99 though. See you then. Okay Pancakers, really quickly I just want to tell you, uh, get your farms around here and get how they were before. So one there. You also want to make sure you can place down the farms, so don't upgrade them until you've done it. You can also place one right here. First. Then that one, and then there should be enough room for one there. Then you want to get one here, but you want this one to be down this path. Marketplace variable bananas. Get one here. And then of course get another one in range. After you've done that, you want to upgrade them to the tier 4's top path. But also if you want, you can get a druid here. Get down ju jungle's bounty and then get it to a druid of each heart of vengeance. If you do that, get another farm right here. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to get all of those to four two zeros, and I'll see you at round 99. Okay, pancakes. Now what you want to do is you want to upgrade both of these to crossbow masters. Then get a glue gunner down right here, and get a village down right here. You want to set this to first then, and get these two set to earlier. After you've done that, get this to bigger radius, jungle drums, primary training, primary mentoring, grow blocker ra radar scanner, and then get this to a not that path. <laughs> I always go top path, so I always forget when I need to go bottom path. You want to get to a super glue, glue's bladder, um, yeah. Then after you've done that, you want to get this to a central market. Get this to a super monkey fan club. Get this to an ultra juggernaut. And then get another super monkey fan club and start the boss. Make sure to use your ability. Slow down the pace of the thing and then get every single run of the rest of your things to super monkey fan clubs. After you've done that, use your supply drop. And then save up to get this to a uh, special operations. After you get that to a special operations, what you want to do is you want to get this to a shadow and shells, and then get down another mortar monkey down. And you want to get this to artillery battery uh, with that. 
and then these should start dying but you want to use your special preparation ability here just to do that little bit of extra damage use this ability here to do more damage to that boss and then this is a very dangerous wave so you do want to take it a bit more slowly after you've done that though use your use that ability to make them do even more damage and then you want to get it to um, a Plasma Monkey Fan Club, make sure to continue using your money abilities though. After you get to a Plasma Monkey Fan Club, you want to get a Monkey Submarine over here. This one you want to a Gruntonium Reactor Bob Dodsey tip. And then get another Monkey Sub over here to advance Intel with the Strike capabilities. Get another one here to advanced intel with uh, armor piercing. And get a final one here to advanced intel with armor piercing. Use this ability to do a lot more damage to everything and use your special preparations ability with this. Just to do a lot more damage to the boss. And now what you want to do is you want to save up to get this to a... Uh, first you want to get this one to a Spear of the Force. And then you want to get this to a Monkey Wall Street. Use that ability when uh, your Plasma Monkey's off cooldown just for that little bit of extra trip damage. It's stunned our balloons, but we're going to be getting a Monkey Wall Street soon. Make sure to continue using these abilities. Uh, use your first strike capability. Then use your Plasma Monkey Fan Club. And then this and then that. Now we have a Monkey Wall Street, so we shouldn't have to worry too much about picking up the money from those. After you do that, you want to put another banana farm down here. Make sure it's in range of this, but also in range of this. And then get to a banana research facility. After you get to a banana research facility, what you want to do is get this to an energizer, and then you want to get this one here to a central market. After you do that, save up for right before the next boss. I will see you then. Okay, Pancakers, welcome back. The first thing you want to do is upgrade these to Preemptive Strike and then Sub Commander. After you've done that, find your original Dot Monkey, which would be like right here. Upgrade it to Apex Plasma Monkey and put all of your money into it. It should be a really uh, powerful Paragon now. Next thing you want to do is sell every single one of your farms. And then upgrade this to a not exceed score, put all of your money in that too. And then watch as the boss starts dying. Now since we have this space, we want to put this here. And we also want to put another one over here. Actually, we can just put the original one over there. One second, put it right here. <laughs> And then get it to a embrittlement large radius refreeze. You can use that ability to get more money and like always use that too. And it's just gonna be halted at the beginning. You can use these to get even more money. And this boss is gonna be dead extremely quickly. You can use this ability too. You can also use the um, battery batteries ability. You can also use this ability to set your uh, dudes to target over this way. You can also set that to that. Uh, I'm gonna use this again to do even more damage. And there's the boss. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. I repeat Vortex. This is what the map looked like afterwards. Please like and subscribe if you like this type of content, Pancakers. Ring that bell notification to stay up to date with my most recent videos. And have a great day. Bye bye!